sink, baby. Please don't come off. Please don't come off. Please don't come off. Oh yeah, there's a trout. That key, babe, that key, babe. That, that, that's a 12 right there. What's going on, fellas? Welcome back to Living Outdoors. Today, we fish now to Livio, Louisiana, pretty close to Port of Fushon. And we try to catch speck of trout, redfish, whatever we can catch. We still got some fish offshore. They trying to move in. So we're gonna start our day fishing a little bit offshore. When it gets a, when it gets a little rough, we're gonna move back in shore and try to find some fish for you guys. I'm fishing my boy, Brett, Captain Brett. That's the man right there, the man with the plane. And we try to catch some fish, so you guys stay tuned. We're gonna be popping the four horsemen cork today. The best cork in the market, hands down. Not a sponsor, but I'm a fan. So if it's good out there, I share with you guys. So less talking, more fishing. Welcome back to Living Outdoors. That is. Dude, what the hell is that? Oh my god. You got something? Yeah. Something big? Uh, Swimming like a catfish, maybe? Oh, that's one of those that I caught. I'm gonna be able to swing them. Fucking hit. Cause if these are good to eat, we're doing good because I never caught those. I don't know, but I see. I'm waiting for him to text. No, but that one right there, that for sure, that, that's a pompano. Hit the live well button, just things are dying. It seems to me like they're pretty close to the rocks. Oh, yeah, that's a fish right there. A nicer one? Yeah, this one ought to be a little better. Shaking the head. Oh yeah, there's a trout. That key, babe, that key, babe. That that that's a 12 right there. That's a 12 right there. Stay in the boat, babe. Stay in the boat. <laughs> Let me know if that's a trail. Let's see if I get my little bite right here. Dude, I almost got the rod out of my hand, dude. Damn, yeah, that ain't no trail. Mine is not. Uh, well, they getting, they getting close, Yours is 12? Oh, it's my check, but it's gotta be. Yeah, you can and a half. Yeah, I don't think that mine is gonna be a trail though. That don't look like a trail, huh? Nah, fuck it. Woo! Please don't pop it, please don't pop it. That's a 12. That's a 12, Brett. Need another click? Yeah. That's a 12. Where you at? I don't know for how long they're gonna be here. In this area, we're fishing pretty much. You got the option to fish, huh? Nice one. Nice one? Nice catfish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> As I was saying, this area you can fish the beach side, you can fish the rocks, you can fish the opening between the rocks. If you go fish a spot, let me show. If you go fish a spot, they're not there. Go to the next one, and you're gonna find them. 
I like to, to like to hold the line on one hand and then I just guide with this hook right here. I guide until I get close to the hook and then you, you gotta flip it like towards the water like this right here. Ooh. But you gotta keep it tight though. And then that way this line is too thin. Yeah. Just flip like towards the water and shake a little bit. But yeah, if you fish the beach, don't get a bite, go about 50 foot off the beach. Don't get a bite, come behind the rocks. Don't get a bite, go outside the rocks. Trout's a school fish. So they're gonna be piled up somewhere, just gotta find them. Oh yeah, but really like let oh ooh ooh shake the head baby shake the head miss lady fish now oh, there's a trout there you know keeper though That's a red. Oh, oh dude, that's a big trout, bro. Oh, a huge ladyfish. But you see how, how the rod is hitting like... Yeah. Look at the size of this trout, bro. Look at the size of this trout, bro. Woo! They're right here, they cut a new, dude. Ah, nice. Think that big, that big trout, you think? Yeah, that's a nice one, though. Two! Broke my line too. All right. Ah. Yeah. Don't know what that is, but. Oh. Is... Oh. Little mangrove snapper. You know what that is? Mangrove snapper? Yeah. That went as much. I knew I lost my fucking. They gotta be 12 inches, I think. I knew I lost my goddamn hook. Fucking with them rocks. I should have hooks somewhere. The what? Yeah, the Where? Yeah, no. Golly! Dude, that shit. Ah, please don't come off. Dude, it hit like a lightning, bro. Oh, it's a trout. Dude, that thing hit like a lightning, bro. You missed on all the fish, bro. Dude, that shrimp fell. That thing hit like chum. Y'all check this out. Guys, let me tell y'all something. One of the main ways to catch fish in Louisiana, anywhere, speckled trout fish, especially down here, is popping a cork. They have thousands and thousands of corks out there. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you know that I'm a four horseman court guy. Literally. Y'all listen to that. Titanium wire. Titanium wire. It never breaks. Look at the noise. The trout really can resist it. If y'all haven't tried it out, you're missing out. Go try to catch another fish.
big trout. Look at the size of the trout, bro. Definitely a keeper. Oh, it's a red fish. Red, red. I'm about to fix the boat that we can fish really straight right now. Right now, I'm fucking now running the current. First red fish of the day. That's what we call a red red. Red fish gotta be 16, 16 inches or, or bigger to keep. You getting bites at least? Yeah. Oh my God. Please be a trout. Please be a trout. Please don't come off. Please don't come off. Please don't come off. <laughs> bro, look at the size of this trout, bro. Oh, man. Why don't you try to cast from up here, too? It might be a little better for you. Man, I'm trying to Do get a little click in there, please, on the click. Chow. That's nice. You want to measure that? Nah. That's a, that's a couple pounds. Trying to get on them rocks, you you getting right up on them rocks, man. I can't uh. I keep That's what I'm up. saying. Come up in here. I keep coming up yeah. short. I'm getting my bites, kind of. Yeah, Suey. Yeah. Mangrove, mangrove. Don't look too big. Mangrove, mangrove snap. Those are one of the best eating fish, dude. Well, you gotta be, gotta be, you gotta, gotta be twelve, yeah. yeah. He moved to Mississippi. Dude, I saw, oh my god. I saw his, look at the size of the red. He came off. Saw the size of the bull red. Look what happened. Popped my freaking line. Feels like a nice fish. Little drum. First cast of the boomer shrimp, man. Huh? Yeah, ah. Uh. Oh, that's a big old red. Sing, baby. Just hooked up to a big old red fish. I don't know if the camera's recording the whole thing, but uh, I just man, that's gonna that's gonna be a good fight right here. That's a patience game right here, guys. The fish wanna give, you take it. If you not, let it happen. Whenever the fish is time, the fish is time. Whenever it's my time, it's my time. Gotta make sure to keep a pressure on that line. I got a super thin line, so I gotta watch for his mouth. I cannot let the serrated mouth. You always gotta make sure your brakes not too loose, but also it's not too tight. If 
you try to horse the fish in, you're gonna pop your line every time. He's not far from the boat though. I can see his wake right here. I'm gonna try to put his head on the net. Now, guys, that's the time that we lose 90% of the fish. Because we lose stretch on the line. Let's try to put his head first. We're gonna rattle the blade on his mouth. He's well hooked. Wow. Oh yeah. <laughs> Guys, look at the size of this red fish. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Alright, we gotta be quick with him. Guys, I'm gonna cut the recording right here. I'm gonna take some pictures and I'll be back with y'all. That was a big fight. Time to try to put the sock in the water. Oh no. Are oh, you in? I was gonna play that too much fish. 25 pound red fish. Focus. Last red fish we caught. It's a little eight two old shrimp. Quite a chartreuse. 12 pound liter. In the four horsemen cork. And guess what? We smoked them today. I'm tired. That fish wore me out. But uh we did good. Got a few pictures. Not the best pictures I could take how the fish was too heavy. Couldn't get it straight for y'all. But that's it. See if we can catch some more. Woo! Trout. Oh yeah, there's a keeper. On the fake shrimp. The only reason why I stopped using the live shrimp was just because I was getting tired of keeping swapping baits. Yeah. Nice speck of trout. No measurement needed. You always pull a couple of trouts out of here. There's a trout, there's a trout. And that keeps you, that's a, that's a trout. What I told you? You gonna believe me now? I'm not gonna stand longer than this. <laughs> Expecting You gonna believe me now? Oh, that's a nice 13 right there. You got another one? Ah, uh, yeah, that was our 11, like 10 and a half, 11. There's a baby right there. But you know what that means? That means that uh, they want some shrimp. They don't want other fish, so let's give them some shrimp. I did watch a lot of his shit though. Ooh! First cast the live shrimp. Ooh. And that's a keeper too. Live shrimp? No, that shrimp. <laughs> so that's 11. Right? Nine, you call one, I call one. 
if you st oh fuck if you stop getting bites they take in front of me right here on the channel Swimming like a trout. Yeah, That's a baby trout. At least you're right though. You did feel a little shake. Fucking like instant, bro. Oh, that's a nice one, babe. That's a keep, that keep, that keep. That's 13 a little bit. You'll catch me one and then. See, I cannot hook them. You got it? I think you, so, you, much, so much for the knife, one, huh? I think it was your cork that was. <laughs> the cork was hanging back. Mm -hmm. yeah, All right, folks, that's it for today. We caught some fish, a lot of small fish, some big fish, actually some really big fish that was about, what, 30, 36 inches, 38 inches? Yeah. Caught a 38 inch red fish on a 12 pound liter. That's Louisiana right there for you guys. That's Louisiana, I gotta love it. And uh, we put 15 speck of trout on the boat, caught a lot of small ones, lost some big fish, but that's how fishing goes. It's hot, I'm tired and we're hungry. So thank you for watching, make sure to subscribe and smash the like button and see you guys next time.